may be too late in the game already, but this video will feature lip swatches from my first ever haul from the makeup brand Colourpop Cosmetics. If you're curious to see what I got, then please keep on watching. I actually already knew of the Colourpop brand. 2-3 years ago back when it first launched through my friends Kix and Elaine. Hi girls if you're watching! What do I know about Colourpop? I know that it's an affordable drugstore brand that's totally worth your money because aside from it being reasonably priced, they have a wide range of color selections which makes it really interesting and the quality is said to be really really good. The lipsticks are overly pigmented and the eyeshadows, <laughs> the eyeshadows are very very soft, creamy and velvety. Fast forward. Fast forward to two years and a makeup buying ban later. Last May, I suddenly found myself being crazily obsessed over the brand. Not really sure what triggered it, but I was just constantly browsing through the website, listing down the products that I like, listing down the shades that I wanted to buy, looking for swatches online, watching and reading through a lot of reviews. It's in crazy obsessed, crazy obsessed. But one of the big challenges I had back then is that I wasn't sure how to source the products here in Japan. Because similar to Manila, Colourpop Cosmetics is not yet available in malls and stores here in Tokyo. However, unlike Manila, there aren't a lot of online sellers here. No. <laughs> so, what's a makeup junkie like me to do? Of course, I scoured through the internet for ways through which I can source the products here. And one way is to avail the services of an international personal shopper from websites such as shopandbox.com and parcelpoppy.com. So I started looking into that and was already ready to hit the order button when this happened. And the rest, my friends, is history and in this box. <laughs> Just charge a separate shipping fee because I ordered just when they started offering international shipping. But I think now you can actually already waive this fee when you reach a certain amount. In terms of delivery, delivery was actually quicker than expected because they said that it will arrive within 2-3 to three weeks after placing my order. But I placed my order on July 16th and immediately got my package on the 23rd. So it only took them one week to send me my products. Which are... Two brushes, one laundry. Fourteen liquid lipsticks. <laughs> For the sake of time, and since this is a lot to swatch, I'll be dividing this haul into two videos. So I'll be showing you the lip products in this video and the powder products in another video. I actually already featured four of the liquid lipsticks in previous videos, so three of them here and one of them here. I'll put the links to these videos in the information box in case you're interested to see those colors with the full-on makeup look. Okay, so this must be the longest introduction to a swatch video. I'm really sorry. I just had a lot to say. I'm gonna stop talking now and move on to the swatches. Bye!
There you go! These are all the shades that I have. Let me know which one's your favorite by leaving me a comment in the comment section below. <sighs> I feel bad for my lips for having to endure all of that. Give this video a thumbs up to show my lips some love. And be the first one to know when I've uploaded part 2 of my Colourpop haul by subscribing to my channel. Hit the subscribe button down below. Thanks again for watching and see you next time. Bye!